in the recent update of Figma, making an interactive component become much more easier. Previously you have to make lots of the same thing, just to make a checkbox. But now you do not have to do that. We will learn how to do that in a new way. Hi, I am Alex from Essential Web Apps. And, we make videos on WordPress, website and social media strategy, web design and development. To see our regularly uploaded videos, please hit the subscribe buttons and click the bell icon for notification. First, let's take some icons here, like these. I use the Feather Icons plugin for these. It's free, and you can get some gorgeous icons like these. Now, you have to rename these properly. Give a same name of a pair of icons, then give a status after a forward slash, as I am doing here. Then, convert each of the icons into components. Then, select both similar icons, and click here it says, Combine as variants. Do the same for the rest of the icons. Ok, all set, now let's prototype these. Pull this to this icon. And, as you can see, change to is selected automatically. Give some smart animation here and vice versa. Repeat this for all the other icon sets. And you are all done. You will find this in the assets tab. And you can reuse it over and over again. It is looking very good. So, there you go. If you like this simple trick, please like and share this video. And, I will see you in the next video.